London Bridge, with its proximity to the city, London's waterfront and South Bank, is undergoing a wave of regeneration, transforming this already vibrant cultural destination into a sustainable residential community. London Bridge is a great area to invest in because there's such a mixture both of uh, rental supply and stock and also there's many good facilities here, good eateries and restaurants. Your proximity to the city is something that attracts many corporate tenants um, and in so much as that it means that the landlord will get a very good rental yield. Local transport links mean you have London Bridge Station providing overground and under underground services, uh, approximately eight minutes to Canary Wharf, eight minutes uh, to the West End uh, and as mentioned previously you can jump on the underground there and you're two to four minutes from Bank equally is a 20 to 30 minute walk over the river depending where we are located. That bodes well for 106 Western Street, a small boutique development consisting of nine apartments, just five minutes walk from London Bridge. With completion in 2013, investors can take advantage of London's economic recovery and growth from regeneration. With regards to rental, rental prices and what's happened in the marketplace in the last few years, uh, rental prices in 07 um, into 08 tended to drop quite dramatically. A lot of tenants tended to stay put and renew their contracts, which caused landlords to become a little bit nervous. However, with the resulting supply of property declining, many, many uh, new renters into the market had to come in and pay a premium. And this is set to continue, given that most landlords are holding on to stock. Rents in London have increased by 16% over the past 12 months, a trend which is set to continue. Given the deep pool of tenants around the London Bridge area working in the city, and with the Shard set to complete in the summer next year, London Bridge is an investor's dream. The Shard, as you can see in the background, uh, will be an 87-storey building when it's complete and the largest building of its kind in Europe. It will be a mix of residential units, luxury apartments, uh, boutique shops, uh, retail outlets, restaurants, viewing areas and uh, also the Shangri-La Hotel will be there with one of its famous lobby areas. The SE1 postcode has become ever more desirable in recent years, with current developments such as the Shard bringing more attention to the area, other Bermondsey Spa being regenerated and millions and millions of pounds being spent on the area to increase public facilities and transport links. London Bridge Quarter um, is also increasing the public transport in and out of the area, with many people, local residents, still wishing to commute by cycle uh, or by even walk over the bridge and into the city. The values in the area currently uh, between £650 and £900 a foot, depending on which part of the postcode you're buying in. This is set to increase when new levels are set by the Shard, with the top apartments there reputedly being traded or will be traded at £4,000 a square foot. The Shard is just one of several planned regeneration projects between London Bridge and Tower Bridge. This regeneration has been driven by the cultural and leisure facilities on the South Bank, which is attracting more and more people to the area. As a result, property prices have increased 6.9% year on year, with Southwark the third highest performing borough in London. Uh, the other thing that SE1's well known for is Borough Market. For years it's been the food capital uh, of London and the market is getting ever bigger and spreading. Uh, it's now known as London's Larder, with many people, tourists and locals, travelling there on a regular basis to buy local produce. With London becoming ever more popular and house prices set to increase and the rental demand uh, increase along with it, it now seems to be an excellent opportunity to, uh, to buy and invest in the SE1 area. London's economy is moving from recession to recovery. I think London in particular, with its time zone, with its location, with its language, is a perfect place for people to invest. And as a result, you will see London's, not only London's economy growing, but also the number of uh, new buildings, uh, and the regeneration opportunities growing and multiplying as well. So the future for regeneration is, is, a, is a, you know, I'm very optimistic and I think there's a fantastic future for regeneration in the capital. With excellent capital growth projections and a 5.2% rent guarantee for three years, make 106 Western Street your next property investment.